Good evening. Welcome to Pillow Talk with Jay. I want to thank you all so much for allowing me to share a tiny portion of your evening with you. I hope all is well with you and yours. You all, please do me a favor. Go to our page and like our page at the J Spot. Follow us on Twitter at J Spot. Also follow us on Instagram at the J Spot Radio. And J is spelled J-A-Y-E. And also go to our YouTube channel and like and subscribe our YouTube channel, you guys. We have some exclusive content that will be only coming there to uh, YouTube as well as um, on Facebook Live. So definitely do me a favor. Go to our page and subscribe today. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. We have the link in the comments and that's the J Spot Radio. God's again, thank you so much. I have missed you all. It has been such an amazing summer, guys. It's been so busy. The J Spot Airbnb has been keeping me busy so much, guys. So I'm sorry I haven't been able to jump on as much as I had liked to. But again, thank you guys for just showing up when y'all saw the notification then again. Hey Ronte, how you doing? But guys, listen, tonight we're talking about don't settle for less don't settle everyone desires to be loved but sometimes some of us give more love than we receive stop giving out more than you're getting in return Sometimes we stay so focused on the other person's needs that we forget that what we want and what we need, we're not getting it. So we got to stop. Don't settle for less. Don't settle. You got to stop letting people half love you. One minute they're loving you. The next minute, they don't know who you are. Stop accepting scraps and leftovers from people when you know that you deserve the full meal. Don't settle for less. You deserved to be loved completely. Again, you deserve to be loved completely. If a person can't make up their mind, if they're going to love you completely, don't continue to fuss over it. Don't continue to try to convince. The last thing you want to do is try to convince somebody to love you. Don't settle for less. Don't. At some point, you have to know when to just, you know what, let it be. But stop settling for less. Don't let anyone cause you to think that you don't deserve to be loved. No matter what, you're not asking for too much. They're just providing too little. Just because some folks may not be capable of loving you the way you need to be loved. Doesn't mean that someone else isn't capable or even willing to love you the way you need to be loved. You got to remember that some things that your partner may not care for about you, but here's the deal. When people love you, they're going to accept you. Flaws and all. Because guess what? None of us are perfect. Nobody's perfect. So don't settle for less. How you doing, Darcel? If you can accept them and all the ish and all the madness that surrounds them, you can accept all that ish completely in spite of, then they should be able to accept you. Because you deserve the same. The same effort and the same energy that you put out into loving them, you deserve to get that in return. So don't settle for less. Listen, 
Don't sit up here and try to argue with folks, nag folks, and convince folks. Now, I do believe in having a conversation. But after so many conversations have been had, you know, it's time for some decisions to be made. I don't care what you look like, what you've done, where you've been. How many kids you got? How many ex-husbands, ex-wives, baby daddies, baby mamas? I don't care about any of that. How much money you have, how much money you don't have. There is someone that is willing to love you just the way you are. Just the way you are. Because you're perfect. You're just right for that person. Ronte, you're saying, I was saying this today to one of my friends. I'm tired of giving my energy and love to someone that halfway loved me. Sometimes I'm thinking that I'm better off alone and have someone that, hold on, I'm sorry, you can, um, and have someone that I spend time with on occasion. Since I'm in my mid-40s now, my patience with someone that does not, does me wrong is pretty done. How you doing, Michael? I totally, listen, Ronte, that is totally a valid feeling and it's a valid point. And again, we should not be settling for less because again, there is someone that's going to love you just the way you are. If a person makes it seem or make you feel like you're hard to love, sometimes you just got to step back. You got to remember you deserve more. You got to say it to yourself. Listen, I deserve more than this. I deserve better than this. But don't you dare settle for less. Don't you dare. Never feed into people's ideal of who you are or what you are. You don't have to fit into the box or a category that people or even society have decided to place you in. You don't have, listen, you make your own rules. Do your own thing. Be who you are. No one can tell you who you are because no one has walked in your shoes. Everyone is entitled to their opinion of you, but you don't have to buy into it because guess what? It's their opinion. You know where you've been. You know where you're going. You know what you've been through. Don't settle. Don't be afraid to tell people how you want to be loved. Some of us, you got to stop keeping it to yourself, being afraid to rock the boat. Listen, if you don't tell folks how you feel, then it's not going to get better. Hey, Gretchen, how you doing? Especially if you know that you're loving a person with all that's in you, with all that you are, and you're getting the bare minimum, don't settle. Don't settle for less. If a person is not willing to hear you out, match your efforts, match your energy, match your vibe, why are you holding on? What are you holding on to? Don't settle. You deserve more. The moment you start to believe it, when you really believe it in your heart and you believe it in your mind that you deserve better, that you deserve the love that you desire, you deserve it, you're going to move differently. When you settle for less than what you know you deserve, you're cheating yourself. Listen, you've been through too much to continue to cheat yourself. You've been through too much to continue to accept less than what you know you deserve. Don't settle. You have to let folks know how you feel. Listen to what they say in response but more importantly watch to see 
if they make the effort that is needed when you're letting them know how you feel and what you need from them. Some folks have zero intention on giving you what it is that you need, what you desire, and what you deserve. They have no intentions whatsoever. Don't settle. Don't settle. You have to know that you're worth it. Even if you're not worth it to them. Because here's the deal. Let's just be real. You're not going to be worth it to everybody. And you shouldn't want to be worth it to everybody. You just want to be worth it to that one somebody. That one somebody. You don't have to be for everybody. This ain't a popularity contest. You just want to be worth it to that one person. Don't settle. Don't settle. You deserve what you desire. Again, sometimes we have to write these type of things down so that we can, and we have to continuously tell ourselves, I deserve what I desire. I deserve what I desire. I deserve what I desire. Don't settle. You're not asking for too much because you want to talk you want to spend time. You want to do things. You want to feel special. You want to make them feel special. You're not asking for too much. It may be too much for them, but for your person, it's not going to be too much. Don't settle for less. People that want to be together will make a way to be together there's nothing that can keep a man and a woman that's determined to be together there's nothing or no one that will keep them apart there's no excuses there's no games there's no tricks there's no manipulation there's no fighting no nagging. Just don't settle. Don't try to convince a person that you're worth it. If they don't see it, that's okay. You're still worth it. You still deserve to be loved the way that you desire. It may not be from them. But understand this and believe this, your person is out there. So hold on to that thought and keep reminding yourself, keep reminding yourself, I deserve what I desire. I deserve what I desire. Keep reminding yourself that. So when you get tempted to slip back into the old habit of settling for less, Say to yourself, I deserve what I desire. Guys, I want to thank you so much for tuning in. Please go to our YouTube channel. Subscribe to our YouTube channel today. It's the J Spot Radio. Guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Take care of yourselves and each other. Till next time, remember this. You deserve what you desire. Until next time, you guys. Good night. Thank you. Peace out. Good night, you guys.